terrific job. The, the two quarterbacks down uh, early and to come back and the pressure on that young man. Uh, what a game. For well, him. Randy uh, got a very severe knee. It is fourth down and six. The ball at the 30 and here is Uwe von Schaumann. He'll put his tee down on the 36 yard line. But Hebert will hold von Schaumann to attempt a 46 yard field goal. It's got the distance. It's good. Oklahoma takes the lead. A 46-yard field goal by Uwe Von Schaumann. And Oklahoma jumps out in front of Texas, three to nothing. Earl Campbell has carried three, has carried five times for a total of three yards in the game so far. Pitch again it is Campbell. Sweep left. Has some blockers this time. Runs over the man at the 25 and the 26. Earl Campbell's best game. Darrell Hunt, 85, was the man who made the tackle, along with Zach Henderson, 19. Take a look at the outstanding Oklahoma linebacker, Darrell Hunt. Darrell Hunt's going to move over this way, and watch uh, Zach Henderson will slow Earl Campbell up just a little bit, and Darrell Hunt will uh, come in uh, to make the stop. Hunt from Odessa, Texas, and the junior. I tell you, Texas got some more problems. That is their quarterback, their second quarterback. Oh, boy. John Arney is down, and Steve, who would that bring in? We don't even have him on the chart. I'll tell you what, there are three freshmen, Sam Ansley, Sanford Coggins, and one of those two, I think, would be to come in. I would assume Sam Ansley, but I'm not sure. Oh, boy, it looked like almost the same injury. Uh, it's, yeah, Mark McBath was to the, his left leg. This is John Arney's right, and we'll see who... Uh, Coach Akers is talking to down there. Number six. Randy McEachern. Randy McEachern, the uh, red shirt. I don't believe that uh, perhaps John Oney is injured as uh, seriously as uh, Mark Fatt. He is able to walk over to the bench now, so it looks like he's good. We may see him again. Randy McEachern will be the new quarterback for Texas. He is 173 pounds, 5'11". A senior squad man last year from Pasadena. And off and in the backfield, Phil Tabor of Oklahoma stops Jones. Donnie Ham Jones 25. As soon as he got the handoff, 74, Phil Tabor was right in his face. And Texas will have to punt. The roar goes up for Oklahoma's defense. It's fourth and nine. Evidently, Michael Ockin and Johnny Lamb are bringing in plays for Randy. I would imagine they play pretty basic right now. Those passing stats. 41 for Texas. It is indeed a new look Texas team. Here's Earl Campbell. That's the same look. 20, the 50, the 10. He'll score on touchdown Texas. Earl Campbell goes for the score. Steve Hall, the tight end, threw a fine block to the big man. He hurdled one to Oklahoma player. And Texas has scored the first touchdown of this game. Look at the teammates around. Number 20, Earl Campbell in his final game for Texas against Oklahoma. You'll see the perfect balance of speed, power, and balance. He just never, never loses his balance. And that deceptive speed with Steve Hall, the only Oklahoman on the Texas squad, throwing a key block. Eric Slavin will be in to attempt the extra point. He's hit on 21 of 24 so far this season. Slavin picks it up. It is fourth down. They say he is just shy of the first down is where they marked it. It is just inside the five. If, maybe the, a, if the nose of the ball touches the four, it is a first down. Fourth down. Lock keeps it, cuts up inside. And I don't know. Texas says they've held it. He was hit right there at the four. marking it. He did not make it. That's the defensive play of the game right there. Texas has held Oklahoma on fourth down. Johnny Johnson 27. The free safety. There's a guy in there who made the hit. There's a long horn down as we watch this big fourth down play. Thomas Lott number six. Here comes Johnny Johnson. He makes the tackle. Stands him up. He's also hurt. Texas has held Oklahoma. We'll pause here with four minutes and three seconds left to play. Texas 13, Oklahoma 6. 
There's two minutes, 30 seconds left to play in this football game in Dallas. Texas, underdogs by four, maybe five points. Leading second rank and unbeaten Oklahoma, 13 to six. Eric Slavin in his own end zone. Let's see if the Sooners go after him. Oh, they're setting up the return. Eric Slavin gets the kick away, and what a beauty. Oh, it's close. Nixon catches it over his shoulders at 25, goes back inside the 20, up to 25, 30. Slavin's stuck at the 34, down he goes. What a hit. Bruce Schultz, reserve linebacker out of Austin, Texas, a freshman. Came down the field to make that hit. 74 yards on the kick. There it is. Has beaten Oklahoma, upsetting the Sooners 13 to 6. Oklahoma's first loss in 1977. 